welcome to the next session of Connie's Cubs. Um, after the last uh, mission that you were on, um, you're a little bit beat up, but you know you came away feeling pretty successful. Even if two of those things got away, uh, you know you, you sunk a ship. So you know you're kind of feeling good. <laughs> you're you're kind of badass. You got to do something big, no repercussions, and you know you got enough money to drink on. Uh, you found yourselves a couple times in the Sapphire Club, which is our local brothel and bar, and uh, just enjoyed your time. Uh, when suddenly you got a bit of a uh, call to a uh, uh, head to the airfield, something about another mission. So, you know, it was already late at night. Nobody expects you at that time. So in the morning, um, you two kind of hook yourselves up, feel a little bit groggy, a little bit hungover, and then you head to where the hell is it? I know I have it. Oh, my God, I've got to have 60 scenes. There we go. And divide. Oh, and you need tokens, or else you're not going to be able to do anything. we got Gunner. And I'm done. Now, you guys are the only ones left. Uh, do you see the map? Do you have yep, vision yes. and everything? Okay, all right. Um, so you find yourself uh, pulled off. I'm going to drag you over. Um, this is basically a field with a control tower and like two hangar buildings. It's tiny. Um, and uh, there's not even anybody in the tower right now. And you stand here waiting, trying to figure out what in the hell's going on, but you are at the meeting time. Uh, and, oh, where is it? God, I've got everything pulled apart from my uh, <laughs> scenarios. Uh, yeah. And suddenly, as you're uh, going along, wait, or, you know, kind of looking around, waiting, you hear uh, faint sounds of a biplane. And uh, you look up, or not a biplane, an airplane. And as you look up, you see this beautiful, just shining silver plane coming in two wings not four this is like you know the the speed record planes you see, this thing is almost as fast as the seaplane which at this time are the fastest planes in the world by the way um, this thing is noted for its speed um, it looks like you think the the one that broke the record crossing the atlantic and this thing just comes barreling in flaring out the last minute flaps dropping Engine just about cutting out and sets down on what is a very short field for such a fast aircraft, but it, it, it gets there. And it uh, comes rolling up right to the control tower. Um, engine starts shutting down. Cockpit thing, it's actually got one, opens up. And the picker gets out and just kind of is dusting off. And reaching behind the seat and pulling some stuff out from behind. Um, I guess I could, I don't have a plane, but I can put this one on the map. Boop. And let's just say that this one is it over here. And she just grabs her bags and just starts walking towards you guys. And why? It's not. Yeah, that's fine. Hey, you guys, this week's Cubs. Um, woman about five three, full pilots get up, carrying a big old duffel bag. She walks up to you guys. That's who's asking. Teresa. I'm with the Cubs just like you guys, I assume. You are, you know, you, you have badges, I assume, which you do. <coughs> yeah. Well, you think you know, I'll, say, yeah. I'll show you mine if <laughs> I show, you, show me yours. <laughs> she laughs and actually pulls out a, a rather well-worn. This, this thing has been beat up, but 
pulls out a badge. He's like, so did they tell you anything? No, other than here. Oh, well, I was told to come bring what I could. I, I, I got some goodies here in this bag here. Um, let, let me show you, or let me, let me tell you what I know. And I was told not to wait just to, you know, we, we have to go now. Um, there's some guy in a cabin in the woods and we've got to make sure that he isn't stopped doing whatever it is he's doing. Um, I know we go out 26 or not 26. Uh, uh, oh, they call it highway 30. Now it used to be St. Helens road, but we go out highway 30 and there's a dirt road. We go to the end and that's where we go. Apparently we need to make a stand and keep this guy safe. That's it. That's all I know. We're keeping a guy safe or we're stopping him from doing whatever he's doing? No, no, no. Keeping him safe. He's got to finish what he's doing. It's important. That's all I know. He has to finish. He has right. to finish. And our job is to make sure he does. I, it's supposed to be today, as far as I know. I look at Gunner. You sober enough? <laughs> I'm always sober enough. <laughs> what kind of weapons are you packing? I got I got a couple of Tommies, some M1s, and uh, hand you a. Are Are you the bomb guy? Uh, I've got I've got some things that go boom. All right, and she hands you a kind of a little little bag, not real big, but it's it's hefty. Here, you will probably be able to use these. And. Uh, She's like, guys got a car, which you do. You happen to have a local car that you got, or a yeah, a car that you got, or a truck rather. I'm sorry, a truck. Um, just um, yeah, we got one, wheels. Yeah. Does that have a back seat, or is it just the one like a front? Like it's like a big front. bench seat. You'll have to jam the front and the bench seat. So you you're riding you're riding bitch. Yeah. I, I thought I was going to be driving, but I am tired. And she goes, all right. And so she goes in and she goes, let's go. Y'all load up, head in this truck. And let me go and change something here. Why is it? Oh. Welcome to Portland. Let me give you a token. Special. I thought we uh, teleported to outer London with that biplane. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You guys happen as to be. Oh, there's two pies. Uh, Tony will ask. So what do we what do we know about this guy that we're supposed to be keeping safe? Was he Marcus? Some old guy named Marcus. That's all I know. Old guy named Marcus. Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know how these missions are. We never know a damn thing. We just go in and Super try not specific. to die. Yeah, they're they're great that way. But you know, they they don't, they don't also don't wait around if it was important. They, they they you know, they'd let us know. So that must be what's important. Is uh, is it, you own that plane? Yeah, of course it was. That's a sweet, sweet ride. Oh, well, is this, is this in the city that we're going to, or is this out on the outskirts? Someplace way out in the woods. Uh, but, you know, one thing you noticed about this city is it's got a thriving downtown, and you go four miles, and it's a pine forest. <laughs> it is a very bizarre little city if you haven't been there, so... Um, you guys head off. I don't know if you can even see the map. I'm just doing it. Um, you guys head north along the Columbia River on the south bank. Um, these are the the the, it, it, the trees that grow here are big. These are not small. This is it's not redwoods, but you know the the fir and the pines out here are strong and big. Uh, 
and you go driving along and it actually takes a little bit of clearing to clear the dirt after, after you turn off highway 30, which is, you know, there's a brand new, one of the earliest numbered highways, uh, you turn off onto this dirt road right off of it. Um, there is just this little dirt path going that back into the trees, like a super long driveway would be. And, uh, off you go. You actually have to stop and clear branches. You know, this is not a well-traveled road. Uh, at a certain point, you come to a bridge, a little rickety, but you get over it, and it's over, like, on one side is a waterfall, and just, you know, these sheer walls and kind of a cliff. I mean, this is a beautiful place. Um, you know, this isn't the first, there's creeks everywhere when you're going through the woods out here. And, uh, you know, this is, this is a more of a creek, maybe a little bit bigger, almost a river. Um, you know, depending on how you call it, it's, and there's a lot of water. It's April, it's spring, we still have snow melt come down, and it is kind of roaring. About a quarter mile past that is where you come to the cabin. And it is just really kind of bleak looking. Kill this, kill this, kill this, and oh, uh -huh. and let's see. Oh. Well, you're not there, you're not there, you're not there, and you're not there. All right, <laughs> I was expecting more. Can you tell? And you can hear, you know, there's, there's smoke coming from the chimney as you pull up. And as uh, you do pull up, a uh, girl, 17, 18, it's hard to tell. Um, she looks like she's native. Uh, she comes out to you and she's, you know, looking at you very suspiciously. As we pull up, what's it smell like? Um, very acrid, um, the, 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 yeah, I would call it yeah, very acrid, very herbal, if that makes sense. It's like somebody's burning tea bags. Just a touch of sulfur in it that just kind of gives it a burn. Mm. Um. The woods are quiet. Too close to the, I'm not going to get too close to the cabin. I'm probably going to be about 30 feet away from it. But Okay. All right. I'll, um, let, her, I, I'll let her come to me. And uh, she does so. I would like both of you to roll a spot hidden for me, if you would, please. Wait, Here, I'll pop it into chat for okay. you. Oh, you got it? All right. Uh, sure it did. Uh, why can't I? Is it saying giving you a permission error? No, it's no. like wanting me to edit it, but not click on it to roll. Oh, uh, ba -ba -ba. here, let me. Let's see. You. Oh, I want the same thing from both of you. So no problem. Do I need to lock it first? Uh, nah, you're fine. Maybe. Uh, okay, Tony, forty-six. Let me just check something. Yeah. Um, Gunner, spot hidden. Whoops. Push. Uh, you're going to push it? Go ahead. Uh, uh, okay, hold on. Pushing roll. Um, oh, you're... Okay. It's like claiming it. So. Got it. Got it. Mine. <laughs> this back up. Now we'll run it. Oh, there you go. I don't know why it's rolling for me. Ooh. Anyway, okay, uh, we'll go with that. Damn, Gunner. As you're looking, uh, I need to find something here. Uh, you see, as you're going along, um, let me get this right here. As you're standing there waiting for her, her to walk up to you guys, you catch a glimpse of movement in the trees off to your left. Um, and as you look, 
Where is it? This is going to be this. I don't know if you see it. Immediately pick out the hand grenade. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, you literally see what looks like a rat with the face of a man. Um, it's about, uh, you know, like a fat, big cat. Maine Coon's size cat. And it's just a little bit ugly. Um, and it just looks, yeah. Um, I need you to roll a sanity check for me. Oh, shit. Uh, Tony got it. All right. Uh, roll. Uh, let's see. Tony, you got it. Good. You take, or do you take anything? You have to look. These guys. Wow. Um, you lose one sanity point. Uh, Gunner, you lose... Wait, I only have 82 right now instead of 99, by the way. Is that my max? Uh, yeah, that's uh, your, your max. Uh, you, you lost some sanity in the last game from the different things that happened. That right. recovers much more slowly. Okay. You can, like, get one or two points back a month in this game. Got so, it. um, And it's been just a couple of nights. So, um, so yeah, you will do 1d4 um, sanity loss. Which is not, you're, you're okay. It's, you know, for now. Um, as you guys look, you see this hideous thing. It is just wrong on so many levels. And it just, you, you realize that you're like looking into, I mean, you've dealt with a lot of cultists and things like that. And you've dealt with some pretty weird stuff. And this is in the category of pretty weird stuff. Um, you know, uh, Charlie's like, yeah, those are our friends. They've been with us for days. Um, who are you? And why are you here? I'm going to turn and look at Teresa. Um, <laughs> she just looks at you. Look <laughs> at both of you. Fine. Kind of shoves between you guys, walks up and goes... Pulls out her badge. Says, BSI, we're here to keep you safe. And uh, Sally <laughs> reaches into her little pouch and pulls out a little badge. She goes, I just got this. Well, I'm glad to see you. We've been kind of on our own here. Um, what, now that uh, introductions are taken care of. Uh, Tony, by the way, this is Gunner. What the hell is that thing? And how many are there? You I don't said know. Friends, plural. Yeah, they're they're scattered all around. They don't get close, but they've been watching us. And no, I don't know what it means. And and the old man won't say a damn thing. How long have you been here? Uh just a couple of I used to work for him just grabbing stuff. Now I'm with you guys, I guess. And um, uh, you know, for a couple of days now, let me think. What is the Three days. <laughs> she goes, I got this badge three days ago. Any any attacks or they're just, well, just keeping their distance? Uh, yeah, they, they've been keeping their distance, but, you know, they definitely are paying attention. What, why, are, why did they send you? I mean, I'm glad you're here, but why did they send you? We were told to let this guy finish what he's trying to do, and that's all we know. What's he doing? Well, come on in and see. And she kind of leads you up, and uh, she just walks off, turns around, and heads off to the cabin. And you look, you can see that you know she's wearing you know kind of old dungaree looking clothes, and it's not that she's poor; she's just filthy. She's wearing work clothes because she's get she's just grubby as hell right now. All right, I'll follow her up there. Right. As we walk to the door, I'm going to keep, keep my eye on that thing. I'm going to follow her up. I'm going to watch that thing as I'm going up. 
All right. And as you do, you realize that there are, there's a couple of them as you get closer, and they're just kind of in a perimeter. They're not in the closest trees, but you can, like, see them kind of, like, peeking from, like, four trees back, right? So you're talking yards and yards, probably, like, 30 yards. You know, they're not clear, but you can see them. How many do I see? Like, uh, like how many can I clock? Um, there's at least six. I mean, they're, they're, they're out there. As we get into the cabin, I'm going to sidle up to Gunner and say, kind of out of the side of my mouth. I clocked at least six out there. All right. Hmm. So it looks like they might have us surrounded. There might be some out back, too. We just got to be ready. As, Roger. As you guys clear the inside, you see this remarkably old man um, come up. Let's see if I've got. I don't think I have any artwork for him. Yeah. Um, but you can see he looks like he's in his 70s or 80s. He's a little guy. And as Sally walks in, you know, she's like, well, they sent more people to help us, at least help protect us anyway. And like, ah. He just shakes his head and you see him he's there's pots lots of pots all over here um they're perfectly round clay pots and they've got a top on it and you know that that kind of screws on and they're just being stuffed full of stuff he's like got just like pouring out of a giant bucket into this thing and you see stacks where there's like charcoal and you know, powdered something, you know, like, looks almost like powdered gravel or chalk, um, bundles of herbs ground up and just all these different things laid out in a big line of buckets. And you can see where they've been just filling these things like an assembly line. So what is it? Hey, hey uh, Marcus. Yeah. You uh, want to fill us in? Well, um, we, what you doing? We have a bit of a weapon here, but we got to protect the weapon. Mm hmm. And uh, what's the weapon for? Well, uh, well the other guys are going to come back and take it and do something with it, or well. They're going to take it and do something very special with this weapon. Hopefully stop some of what's going on in this town. I mean, crazy, bud, but uh, I, I've seen a lot of weapons in my time. This is a funny looking weapon. Oh, th no, this isn't the weapon, you silly man. Ah, kids. No, this, these are called smudge pots, buddy. They, they give off smoke. I, I, I know that's, you know, a, a weird thing, but this keeps those things, you kind of thumbs out, from no one being able to get close to us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why do you think it stinks in here? You think I like this smell? Don't know what you like and what you don't. You're looking around the cabin. <laughs> there you go. Where's, where's the weapon? That that's no concern to you. I, I'm not that. That's it, it's being protected somewhere. It's protected by more than you can give. Hmm. Okay, so let me get this straight. The smoke that you're making keeps those man mice things at bay. Is that what I'm hearing? Yeah, I'm not worried about them. They're little things. So like what are you worried is, about? What is the smoke keeping at bay? Well, he kind of looks at you. He goes, bigger things. Dangerous things. All right, look, old man. I'm out here risking my life to save your life. You're going to have to open up a little bit or I'm going to get pissed. What kind of bigger things? I don't even know what they're called. 
things that just leap out of the corners of reality. And they'll rip you apart. They look like. If it's not those things, we haven't seen them yet, so what do they look like? We're going to know what the hell we're shooting at if we're going to start shooting. Uh, I don't know. I really don't. I then mean, how do just... you know that these things work? I'm not alive, aren't I? Look at Gunner. Gunner. Yeah, be, I mean, if you want to be useful, you can stand guard. I, I am sorely appreciative of that, sir. I'm, right, but that I have to do work. To me. I mean, I'm gonna, know. I'm gonna turn around. I'm, oh, were, there, did, were there any? Was there like a front porch? Yeah, there's a there's a front porch. It's you know, there's a front porch and a little back porch and trees. That's all really right. all you see, unless you're like examining. You know, but yeah, that's. There, um, a lofted area and or a basement. Like I said, door going down. You know. um, no, it just looks like basically three rooms. You've got like there's a long, thin bedroom along the back of the building. It's got a door into it and then another door that goes out the back. A little kitchen area and then a living area with like tables and stuff jammed in there. Just a mixture of like personal effects and like weird knickknacks and stuff. Lots of books and papers. Kitchen's kind of gross, but, you know. I'm going to start looking around. How many, like, how many windows and potential entrances into this place? Um, just looking around to see in what ways I could secure the building. Um, let me see your sheet here. Well, while we're looking around, uh, Gunner's going to pull out his pack of Lucky Strikes and have a smoke. <laughs> uh, let's see here. As you make an intelligence. Go ahead and make an, uh, an education check for me. Which is. You light up. Tony, look at that. Careful where you light that. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what in here is. Yeah. <laughs> a little more smoke won't hurt anything. I'm worried about smoke. I'm worried about fire. Um, let's see. Looking at Anthony, yeah. Shift. I think this will request it. There you go. Got it. It's in chat for you. If you'll just click that for me. They're giving you fits. Did you see it, Adam? Oh, I can see. It. Oh, yeah. Click if you, yeah. It's a, yeah. It's it's in chat. It's I in the uh, foundry chat. No, 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 no. Because you're you're looking around. Uh, it just kind of seems. Like a rickety wooden shack, you you know it's. Mm. Um, you see, like you know, there's gonna, windows on every gonna, wall, doors. I'm gonna push that. I'm gonna push that. That's, Ooh, that's, okay, all right. Yeah. Um, yeah, you get a definite feel that this is not a very secure building. Mm -hmm. uh, it, it looks like something could choose to come through the door of the wall, and it would be equally as difficult. Not very. You're right. It's the the this the roof is old uh, cedar shingles, and you can see where pots have been laid out because it's rotten and leaking, and there's you know to catch the water. Um, you know, not a prime hole up to you. Uh, yeah. Okay. That's good. Um, if I were to pick one room and secure it 
which would be the easiest to do so of the three. Uh, Let's see. You are... You are two-fisted. You're a soldier. Um, you're a gun guy. Are you, are you chatting about this? or? I'm, I'm going to chat. I'm going to ask the old guy while, while Tony's looking around and say, listen, man, we're here to protect what you're working on. We need to know where it's at. I don't give a shit what it is, but we need to know where it's at so we can protect it. We need to be in the best position possible. If you want I the guess best position, whatever the weapon is, that's where you'll be. So, ergo, we protect you. We protect the weapon too. Uh, he he shakes his head. He's like, "Do you want to protect me? You know that bridge was that you drove over." Yeah. Uh-huh. Keep anything from crossing it. That's the only way you're running out of this valley. I'm going to look at Gunner. How far away was that? It's just like a eighth or a quarter mile up the road. It's it's close. I mean, you know, this is like a two and a half mile uh, road. Across a bridge that's not there. I like where you're going with this. Let's do that. If we... We can figure out another way out of this valley, but so do we park the? Do we walk across the bridge, or do we park our? No, car? you drove. You drove across the bridge. Your car is on this side. All right. Yep. Let's. Uh... We'll take a look at the bridge and see what we're looking at. Yeah, let's drive the car down there. All right. And take a look at the bridge. I can go away. All right, so you happy to stick here with him, or you want to come with? Um, she, she's coming with you. She's like, well, I'm not staying here. Why would I stay here? And uh, let's see. Point to, <laughs> I point to Marcus. I'm staying here. I have to work on this stuff, man. It's, you know. All right, mm-hmm. Sally, you stay here with the old man. We're going to go check out that bridge. Okay, and let me do something here. Do, do, Marcus, do. Sally, and Teresa are are staying, or Teresa's uh, coming Teresa's with? coming with you guys. She's not okay. staying. Yeah, she's like, oh no, why did it do that? Hold on, Teresa, Anthony, Gutter. Just for shits and giggles, I'm going to get to the door. Okay, I'm going to stop. I'm going to turn and look at one of those stupid little smoking pots. And I'm going to grab it. Okay. And I'm going to put it in the bed of the truck. Okay. Shrug and say, Yeah. Couldn't hurt, right? Good call. One other thing for you, Marcus, or old man. When is this, when is this weapon supposed to be finished? We're just, we're here to, to see that out. How long, how long do you need? Uh, should be done today, but late. Maybe, nah, maybe tonight. We'll see. I mean, it's about, yeah, thinking about what time it is, by the time you get out there. He goes, yeah, it'll be, it'll be late, but it'll be tonight. All right. Let's roll. All right. Okay. And this is the, you should be on the map. Yep. And what we're going to do here is I'm going to let you, um, You can explore hey, it, Will, I, and ask questions. I need, I need to run to the bathroom real quick. I'll be back. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah, that's that's where we're at anyway. It's, you know, okay. kind of a, a talking break, so to speak. So. Okay. Out, out, out. Okay. Uh, ask Teresa. Um, you got a rifle in that goodie bag of yours? I thought you would never ask. And she pulls out the bag, and it's got, you know, some... M1s and submachine guns Ooh. and ammunition. Like enough to go around Oops. or just that's what she's using? That, that's better. Um, no, she's got enough to go around. You can grab whichever you want. I believe your character sheet might even already have that. 
I don't have an M1, so I'll take one of those. I'll take a. I'll take a. I have a rifle already. But All right. Does she happen to have any thirty at six ammo? Uh, yeah, she does. You ha you you have ammunition. So well, you. not a lot. <laughs> <laughs> That's only what's in your magazine. Um, oh, okay, 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 got it. All right, let me. Da, 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 and I need to edit that real quick. Arms, rifle, shotgun. Okay, you now have a M1 Grand there, Mr. Tony. Gunner, sure. uh, you. And eight in the magazine, but I'm not showing any here. Um, if you uh, left click it, hold on. I'm editing Gunner to get his in real quick. What am I Let's doing? See. Um, you're grabbing a submachine gun. <laughs> uh, all right. I fear you know, you're going to grab each. Yeah. Um, and under combat to load it, just click your mouse button on it and keep clicking until it's full. Um, it's, it's a pain in the submachine guns, but with your rifles, it's easy. Wait, and no, there's I, no faster way to do that. that. Um, so there's just, like a little six shooter thing. Just left click on that. And yeah. it'll, um, click on the, the yeah, the, uh, all right. You're full on everything on anyway. Until it doesn't add any more. Oh, no, I don't have the, I don't have this. I don't see the submachine gun in my. My sheet, that's what I was asking. It's under combat. Yeah, yeah. I've got a three fifty seven and my thirty out six. Uh, right. why is it not showing it should show. I drug it on there. You have a Thompson submachine gun. Let me let me close my sheet and read With, Yeah. You might need to refresh. Oh now I see it. Yeah, I just had to refresh my sheet. Yeah. I think I got you almost up to full ammo now, so 50 okay. freaking clicks. Yeah, you're full ammo. <laughs> and ba -da -ba, ba -da -ba. All right. Okay. So gonna... Teresa, where are you gonna where are you gonna be? Well, where do you think I should go? Um, I was gonna go across that bridge, but I'm not sure I want to be out there. It's starting to get dark out. Yeah, that's crazy. I think you need to be. I think you need to be behind the truck where you have a line of sight down the straight down the bridge we should move the truck turn it around put it to the side use it as cover should probably have the truck turn more towards the road in case any we have to turn around anyway not like that let's say no i was thinking 90 degrees 90 degrees to the bridge uh, yeah there you yeah. go yeah yep. She kind of moves it on. this way so that it's basically aimed down the road to get out. Yep. And then Shh. just post up over here. All right. Looks like I got a pretty clear shot. That works. Let's see her. She's sighting in, playing with that rifle a little bit. I'm going to post up up here. All right. Oops. I can't because there's a collide there, so I'm going to... Yeah, you actually had to so I'm gonna, walk around it, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to try crawl, crawling up this way. All right. And can't get up there. Let me see if there's a way up. Oh, actually, it's... It looks like it's... There is a way. Hold on. Let me show you how. Yeah, after, after a little bit of scrambling around, you kind of come down. How high up is that? It's about 15 feet up. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's it's significant. You you got quite a bit of you, and you're about 30 feet above the water here, so you're you looking to down. No road. A um, little bit. Um, you know. So I'm gonna lay flat on my belly, take the rifle, and no. Oh, all right. Just post up up there. 
All right. And you're behind that tree gun, Gunner? Yeah. Okay. As the day turns to night. Guys, this is place is dark. <laughs> it's almost a new moon, just passed. And it just goes to pitch black shortly after the sun drops behind the uh, the hills. Let me see what you guys got there. Yeah. And just in the twilight, you know, what little light there is, you can just barely see around you. And you hear somebody kind of walking. Hold on a second. What is this? What is which? No. Okay. All right. Um, I would like to remind you, in case you don't know, if you're selected, the very first token is light. Uh, the very first uh, macro at the bottom of your screen says light if you hover, hover over it. And you can select between a flashlight, a lantern, or even a candle. And give yourself a little bit of light. You don't? I don't see any, uh, any macros. No. Oh, well, then... Let me pop it out to you. Where's the light macro? Oh my god, there are so many damn macros here. What the fuck? I'm not going to use it right now. Uh, mm -hmm. Try to let my eyes adjust. As the light dims, but early set it out beside me. Just okay. have it ready. All right. I never realized that that was something you didn't have. Import. And as the sun's setting, probably a couple hours before this, I would have. Called out the gunner. Hey, I don't have eyes on you, so if shit goes sideways. Sound off. Oh yeah, you'll hear me. Trying to figure out where the macro would be so you can use it, because that kind of is important. Mm -hmm. It should be under items, but I don't see it. Do you know how macros show up for people? Um, so there might be something in the compendium packs for me to find. Yeah, if you go to compendium shared tools, you can import if you if if it opens for you. Let me just make sure that it opens and you own it. Configure ownership. Uh, player. Owner. Your tools. Aha, got it. Okay, and then I'll just click right. and drag that over. Yeah, drag that into your token icon bar, or your what uh, am I macro bar. Um, if you go to sh compendiums, which is next to the gears, yeah, I got that. scroll down to shared tools. What is the next station? Oh, Compendium. that's that's for the radio. It, it doesn't. I don't think it works right now. So. Okay. Um, oh, hold on a second. When I do that, and I do import. Right. Well, you can actually just also just drag it down to your token bar, I believe. It'll just... It was like a bar out. with a bunch of numbers at the bottom. Yeah. You can just click and drag it down there to it. Yep. All yep. right. Great. At that point, I think your token has to be selected, but uh, once it is, you just have to click... Uh, that and you get your choice of what you want to use, if anything. I'm gonna I'm gonna not do anything and I'm gonna wait for noises or any sounds or anything. I'm just listening. 
All right. Um, Teresa comes over and she's like, I'm going to go down and just kind of post up and keep my ear out. If you hear me running, I'll be hollering. I mean, something's out there. And you just You're see going across the bridge? I'll just be about in the middle of the bridge. That's where I can see a little bit. All right, listen. I need, when you come, if you're running across that bridge, because I can't see, you need to scream out a safety word. Then I know that you're over the bridge and I can blow this motherfucker if I need to. It'll be, when I, when I yell clear, I'm clear. Sounds good. All right, and uh, she kind of disappears off into the dark. And... Let me do some things. From where I am, can I see her going across the bridge? Just barely. I think I can. Barely. I can see a shadow moving across the bridge. Yeah, I mean, it's there's something there, but you know, it's. We'll start with that. The silence is looming. There's just so little noise. As you sit there, just waiting, waiting for something to happen. Shotgun rings out. And it's quiet. You just kind of... Something's out here. And you oh. see a... You can hear footsteps in the dark. Where she is or somewhere else? Uh, where she was. Okay. And, uh, Gunner here. Don't blow it yet, but I'm clear. I'm just going to test this really quick. I want to see. All right. Okay. That's not very far. No, it's not. And was that's that you? Not very far either. That, was that you? That shotgun? Was that you? Yes. I saw something moving, but I don't know what it was. I'm going to go get ready because I think it was trying to cross the bridge, but I can't be sure. How do I move that light? Uh, was it hold control? Oops. Control and scroll. Are they all the same? Yeah. Uh, some of them see a little further than others, but yeah, the one's wider, one's just real close. All right. Hang on a second. All right, and if I could get... Hang on a second. All right. Do I see what she was talking about on that bridge? Um, give me a listen check, please. Hmm. Just there's just enough wind, you know. There's a slight whisper through the trees and twigs popping and yeah. cracking from that. It's just you can't hear anything, and it's just so dark at this range. You just you can't 
You can see there's a bridge there, but that's about it. Fall down the gunner. Damn water down below. I can't hear anything over it. All right. I need Teresa. I need you to take. Is that a bush right up to her north, or is that a tree? Uh, that is a bush. Big shrub. There's no trees around around her. Um. Back behind the truck. Yeah. Well, she won't be able to see if they're coming. The bus can anyway. How, how far can you throw? How far can I throw a grenade? Um, you can throw it uh, pretty far. Uh, let me check. Hold on. That I do not know. Uh, do, do. Oh, wait. Uh, it should be under your, in your sheet. Let me get to you here. Uh, combat. Uh, where's hand grenade? Oh, you don't have one. All right, hold on. Fighting throw. Let me give you a hand grenade there. No wonder you can't see it. Fifty feet. I can throw a grenade. Wait. Um, the range is whatever your strength is divided by five. So your strength is sixty divided by five. So, what is that? 12. Yeah. So, about twelve yards. There's in yards. Twelve yards. So, uh, thirty, sixty. Roughly, yeah. So, but, yeah. And then what about that <laughs> rifle? Rifle, it's long way, right? Uh, that rifle is got a range of 110 yards before you get out of long into out of uh, you know, starting to push it. I'm just worried that we're not going to blow this thing in the right time if we can't actually see the bridge. But I trace it. Post trace it. Start that truck up. Get those headlights on that bridge. Perfect. All right. And she does just that. I don't have the M1 on my character sheet anymore. Oh, all right. Let, oh, me, well. let me actually open it up again. Let me see if I can do it this way. Yeah. For some reason, it was on a different token. Maybe. And let me modify this slightly. Could have been. Yeah, and I'll drag it in. Give me one second here. Vision. Right. 50. 100. All right. That should show. So it there. shows right up until that beam that goes across it. It doesn't show anything past it. Yeah, let me let me modify that a little more. Brightly anyway. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. Okay, let's see here. Uh, she needs to take cover. Tony. Yeah, yeah, she gets up kind of behind it. Uh, combat. Yeah, your uh, your M one's still showing on mine, along with the uh, Garand, the shove machine gun. Oh, I see it now. Okay. okay. Yeah, when I open up the um, just FYI, so I think it's a difference between the token and the prototype. Yeah. The actual prototype doesn't have it. Gotcha. That's weird. So but okay. If it, goes to, if it goes to another screen, it might not show. Gotcha. Uh, like I said, we do everything theater of the mind in my other game, so I'm not actually used to using the tokens and everything this way. I just tell them what to roll, and we go from there. So it's kind of fun. All right, uh, yeah, do you now see that, uh, you know, uh, you can see most of the way across the bridge, kind of, you know. It's, uh, 
There we go. And uh, make a spot hidden check for me, if you will. Brother, this? Yes. And so will she. Yeah, we're all like dog shit. Where is it? Oh, ooh. You just hear a, they're coming! From Teresa. What, what do I see? Um, well, uh, can you see anything on the bridge? I can. All right, you see something? That's kind of what you see. Yeah. Something small is moving across the bridge. I'm going to take a shot at it. Okay. It's like as soon as it got to like this point. Okay. I would have would have taken a shot at it. All right, let me move him back then. And Okay. Well, if you will, uh, make a check for rifle. Or click your rifle, rather. And I can always pop it if you wish. Should do it. Hang on. There we go. It is a small target. Base range, that's good, yes. And yeah, roll firearm is the white button at the bottom of that in chat. So I'm only seeing a single shot and then... Correct. Well, you're taking one shot, it says single shot, and then yep. it says target, right? And you're yeah. within your base range, and it is a small target. And it says roll firearms below that. Do you see that Got it. below it? Got it? Yeah, that's what you have to click. There you go. Um, wow. Wow. Failure. Oof. Fucking 70% chance of getting it, and yeah, still you... failed it. Um. <laughs> that, that's a pretty bad fail too um, it goes off and as it does so you realize this is you're not you're not used to the the m1 um, yet um, or this particular yeah because the m1 is just coming in and uh, you used a, an older rifle um, you just you didn't quite get it, and uh, you know you, you get quite a bit of flash off the muzzle, and you're just kind of a little bit blinded by it, and you realize you know that shot went wide. Yeah, I'm gonna take another shot if I can get it. Um, let me on make the other sure. one there. Make sure you can. Yep, you can. It will be with a penalty die. Um, okay. So go ahead and click again. Actually, let me uh, let me get thing thing going here since we are now officially fighting. I'm also seeing um, aiming. That's if you take a turn. You'll take a whole round to aim, and you'll get an advantage on it. Okay. Yeah. Oops. Sorry about that. So I'm not sure where the penalty die comes in. Um, second shot in one round. Uh, in, in stores, in, instills a penalty. Okay. My first shot had a penalty die too. Um, small target. Ah. Are you fucking kidding me? Good God. There we go. The wagon can go away. Because the truck is not fighting. Um, okay. What would you end up with? 91. Wow. Okay. The dice hate you tonight. No shit. All right. Uh, 
As you do that, um, Gunner, can you see them? No, Those I can't. Token? Okay, all right. Then they, at that point, they... But, 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 but as I hear him shoot, I'm going to kind of scatter up a couple feet to see if I can. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. But I can't. I'm going to yell down to him. They're crossing on the other side. They're just they're just coming across. And I've seen a couple of them so far. I think there's one more bigger one up at the end. Am I? If I go down here, down where this log is, down at my southeast, laying on the ground, is that kind of still level with the bridge, or is the bridge higher? Bridge is higher. Once you go down, once you get past where you're at, it, it's a steep incline and drops pretty quick, about 15 to 20 feet down to the water. Okay. I'm just it's kind of a hang. little mini gorge. All right. And let's see. Give me a moment. Uh, Oh, I forgot about this. There we go. Kind of hear this weird sound from across the other side of the bridge. And it kind of goes quiet again. And silence settles in. About five minutes go by. If I see a little bigger thing trying to get across, I'm going to take another shot. All right, well, what your tokens see, you see. I can actually see them now. Oh, you have him targeted, so you definitely can see him. <laughs> Seventy percent chance that this this works, and I can't fucking hit it. <laughs> like a thirty percent chance, and I've managed to like squeeze in that little little bandwidth. <laughs> All right. Gunner, what you got? I'm done. Um, can you give me a reminder of how the luck works? Uh, you can uh, use luck points in a one-for-one -one basis. Say you miss by five points. You can use five luck to make that a win. You oh, also I'm have the option. to do that for this shot. <laughs> You're going to do that for that shot. All right. Uh, I believe chat gives you the option to do that if you click it. If I It should say if you scroll it down does. on it. Yep. Um, you can click that and then roll that. Woo! All right, let me see here. And how are you? All right. I'm put it down and just like shake my hands out and, and settle into it. All right, as you finally see that this thing is there, it is, it just kind of... Where is your status, you... Are. It is you, you remember what it is to be a soldier. You put a bullet right through its head. And you see the form of a man just fall right where he stood. The one on the bridge that I was just looking at? Yep. As you're about to take a shot, you just hear um, your Tony's gun ring out a second time and it just collapses. Can I tell you a story real quick? Sure. This just triggered a memory. Back <laughs> when I was in college, I'm not really a hunter anymore, but back when I right. was in college, I used to go deer hunting. And my buddy's uncle lived up in North Georgia mountains. And we would go there and we'd stay at his house and we'd hunt on his, he had like a bunch of property. And I'm up in a tree stand, we're in a valley. And I'm on this side of the, tr the valley in a tree stand, and my buddy is on this other side. And I'm watching this deer come down the bottom of the valley. I'm just watching it, watching it, watching it. 
and I hear a freaking boom and the fucking deer drops as I'm watching it in my scope, in my buddy shot. <laughs> That's pretty wild. <laughs> That's it scared the shit out of me first. Oh yeah, it'll make you jump. I'm like in the zone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. When you get like, you know, that that super focus and then all yeah. of a sudden something like that, you're like, what the? So that just happened to me right now. I'm looking through my scope and yep. the gun scared the shit out of me and the dude just dropped. <laughs> but I think I can see another one down here. So I'm going to take a pop at this guy down here. All right. Well, go ahead and target him. Um, all right. Doing started. Um Oh, okay. All right. Now I see what you're looking at. All right. And, uh, yeah, click uh, whichever one you're shooting with. Uh, a single shot is not doing anything. Uh, hold on. Let me check your sheet. Doop. Yeah, there's another button. So if you click on where it says firearms, rifle, shotgun. Not under skills, but under... Uh... No, under combat. I click the 30 out 6 and then it puts it in this little... Oh, yeah, yeah, right. Okay, now at the bottom, see, see where it says, let's see, your single shot, base range. If you click roll firearms, the white box oh, is a button. Okay. Yeah, it's a button. It's kind of, yeah. I missed it, too. Yeah. Wow. I missed it, too. Yeah, you see that, you know, it, it goes wide. You're shooting downhill, which is arguably tough anyway. You know, it's, it's it throws off the bullet drop and everything for you. And it's close, but it hits the water right next to it. So I needed to roll a forty or below. Yep. Uh, yep. You're, you're wow. not a you're not a rifle guy. You're you're a machine gun guy. <laughs> What's the range on that? Uh, on that it would be. Your Thompson's got a twenty yard range, so that's that's close. Oh, he's in range. But I only have one shot, right? I can't. I don't have two shots. Uh, you can do two. The second one is at a disadvantage, basically. You take a penalty die. But that's it? Yep. All right, well, fuck it. I'm going to switch. Do I take a? Do I have to lose a turn for switching ammo or weapons, or I can just take a shot with my other weapon? Uh, no, you'd actually, you wouldn't, you'd be able to switch out, but you would be able to switch out and fire. All right, I'm going to switch out. Okay, all right. So you'll have your Tommy gun out for next round. Okay. And that leaves Teresa. Although we, we did it out of order because you kind of jumped on it, but that's fine. Oh, uh, sorry. I, I, no, I, no, I no. That's, a, yeah. that's totally okay. Oh, right. I, oh there's, a, there's a combat order there. Yes, there is actually a combat order. Is she? So if, you go uh, to the cross, if you go to the cross swords, uh, so there's the chat bubble, cross swords, little person, oh, suitcase, okay. top right. Got it. So, okay. Um, is there a begin combat thing down at the bottom there? Yeah, or it's it, we're, we're, we're in. We just are not in. I have to wait for the order to catch up. So. Gotcha. Uh, bu, bu, bu. What's Let's that number on that? The right of the... That's the dex number. Uh... Five and ten, yeah, she can't reach. She's just holding with her shotgun because um, she knows that that's just, there's no way a shotgun's going to do anything at that range. And so that's all three of you. This one is next. So let's see. Oh, interesting. Okay. All right, and next is this guy. Where is this guy? All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good eye.
Do these look like the same things that were up by the cabin? Uh, it's dark. Really hard to say. Why are you not going in? Need to change my labels, but that's all right. <laughs> bink, bink, and bink. These guys are slow. Um, you're done. Where are you? You're okay. Teresa's still, you hear Teresa rattling around. Um, she's like, I, I can't hit anything with this thing. I'm switching out. And uh, that's what she does. Uh, Gunner, time's up for you. I'm not sure if okay. you noticed it, but you can see several things on the bridge at this point. I'm gonna. Do, do I lose a half a turn or anything if I want to talk to one of my teammates? No, you can talk. You can talk. Okay. You can talk. So Teresa, because I, so I noticed the one, the one that I shot at at the bridge. I was watching and I could see him, but now I can't see him. Okay. So I'm gonna say, Teresa, you got that one at the top. Um, let me see what she says based on what she can see. Because, yeah, I got him. And she see, you realize she's pulling out a rifle at this point. <coughs> All right, then I'm going to take a shot at this one because I can see these two in okay. the middle of the bridge. And so I'm going to take a shot at this one right here. All right, uh, he is going to do something, though. Uh, let's see if he has any luck. All right. Hmm. All right, he's dodging and weaving, but not very well. Go ahead and see if you can make a shot at him. There you go. Okay, hold on a second. So, all right, here we go. Take a single shot. Oh, wait, your skill's messed up. I don't know why it did that. You got a 47, and your skill... Should have been 49. That should have actually been a hit. Okay. Uh, I don't know why nice. it did not. It should have given you that. It said you've got a zero skill, which is baloney. Uh, SMG. Yeah, that's why yeah, I was that screwed up. Come on. Okay, we got all this stuff I guess, screwed out. All right, uh, you may now roll, and let's go ahead and do damage manually. Da -da -da -da. One d10 plus two on your first shot. Which is the you know, seven, eight, nine, and. My screen went dark, by the way. All right. Like, the illumination just turned off. Okay. All right. Let me get on that in a second. Uh, you look at this thing, just, yeah, it just, it lays it open. Right? You pull that trigger, and it just, you just see it, poof, and it just rolls back about three times, and it's just laying still on the bridge now. Okay, great. 
And let me. And I can take a second shot, but just at disadvantage at another target, or does it have to be the same target? No, uh, it does not have to be the same target, but it is at a disadvantage. Okay, well then, when I get the light back up, I'll see, I'll target that, because I saw another one right next to it. All right, why don't you... Let's see, there's Tony. Yeah, your token vanished. That's weird. All right, I'm going to reach back. Uh, it's, it's on my end. You, need a, you, you don't have a token on screen for some reason, so we'll bring you back. Oop, yep. And you're, you're like oh, somewhere right around there. So. Oh, no, I was actually, I was further back. I was, I was, oh. right, I was up here. Either way, so. Oh, the one next to it, is it dead? Yeah, that's, uh, no, it's not. Why is it saying dead? Oh, it's because of the way the tokens are. Yeah, I shot. The, I killed the one on the, the top side of the bridge. Yeah, that one's dead. This one is still there. Okay, I'm gonna take a pop at him. Okay, this will be at a penalty. Uh, okay, it's not. It's not. Oh, I just do another. Yeah, just click. Click it again, and it yeah, should pop up. Yeah, it's not, it's not adding it to the. Let me check all like that. It's not adding it like it does, and then I go into the chat window and click firearms. It's when I click. Oh, the, no, I know why. It's uh, when your token got deleted, it took you out of combat, too. Boop. So it's not letting you go. Boop, boop, and boop. It was. And yeah. there you go. So, yeah. You should be able to do it now. Uh oh. Oh. Now I'm on here twice. Okay. <laughs> try it again. Now I'm click my one the other one. How are you on here twice? <laughs> I'm on here twice again. Let's see if it'll yeah, let it's me. Not, it's not doing it. Can I just. Well, oh, you, you also have to target. Did you? Is he targeted? Yeah, I'm targeted. I'm targeted and my token is selected. When I click Tommy Gun in my character sheet, it doesn't put it into the chat. Should I reload? Um, I'm having the same problem. I'm not sure what's going on. Hold on. Uh, what you can do is you can just roll. You have a 47 with that. Just roll 100. Uh, the, the 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 2d10. We don't need to 2D10? automate it. Yep, just roll so 2d10. 100. Yeah. Oh, oh badness. Um, yeah, this is a this is a submachine gun. It's not real good for this sort of thing. It's uh, not not a sniper's weapon, so it just you know, you see the the, the railing behind this thing just kind of splinters a little bit as the gun okay, shot rings out. Okay, point that move. Uh, I'm gonna move to right here. If okay. I'm right here, am I still kind of level with the? the yeah, that's all. Yeah, yeah, it's you know maybe down a little bit, but not. You're you're right yeah. in the same area there. Your yeah. your head is about level with the deck of the bridge. Okay. So, all right. That's it. Okay, and Mr. Tony, you find yourself available to act. You see large silhouettes now up on this bridge. Or a large silhouette on the bridge, I believe. Nope. Uh, yeah, so just I right about see there. this. Yeah. I see one back here and one over here. Okay. Yep. You do um, see those. This one is on all fours, and this one. How does it? How is it moving? Uh, like we look from this distance, like I'm seeing these shapes. I can't make out any detail. Do I see something that looks like a dog, and then something really, really weird? Um, okay. you, you, uh, they both have kind of the same. I mean, they're 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 a little different from each other. Maybe in the dark, it's hard to tell, but they've got the same hopping motion that they take, kind of like a toad. Both really friggin' weird. 
Really very weird. Yeah, and this is not a small thing. This is big. These aren't natural movement. Okay. Uh, unless, it, you know, you've seen some toads the size of a small bear or a medium-sized bear. That's not normal. So I'm going to take a shot at this because it's closer to the bridge. All righty. Let's see if it'll let you do it. I'm going to yell down to Gunner and Teresa. Got some bigger ones coming down the way. Happy. Ooh. Ooh, extreme success. All right. Woo. Wow. I am impressed. That is a beautiful, beautiful kill. And I'm going to swing over to this one. Okay. This one's at a penalty. 86. Ouch. But not surprised with the penalty. Yeah. So. Yes, uh, that's that's my turn. I'm, I'm still going to stay posted um, and yell down to Gunner. There's a larger one on the bridge right now. All right. And I'll just... I'm waiting for a big one before I blow this thing. <laughs> They're ready okay. to blow it yet. They're sparky. Yeah, you. Okay. Well, seeing as you're the most recent. Yeah, he is. Okay, Mr. Uh, Mr. Gunner, I need you to try and roll a power check. Power check. Or a con. Wait a minute. Let me make sure. Da -da 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 -da. Do I do that? Um, click on POW at the top. POW at the top of my still my. Top yeah, so my. yeah POW. Click that, and if not, just okay. click the one hundred. And regular. Yes. Um, I heard it. I didn't see it. Same. Yep. Um, Either. What the hell? I think it was a two. Okay, well, let's see. Two, 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 two. Yeah, it takes one round to cast her. I don't know what I'm You doing. feel, no, that's all right, that's all right. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I'll roll that at this point. Uh, for me, plus a three Pretty con. sure it's a one. <laughs> I was trying to be kind of sneaky. <laughs> um, hmm. It really sucks. It's not showing your rolls. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna close this and reopen. Yeah, can, yeah. Can you close it and reopen it? Because that makes it really hard in this case for it to track, right? I mean, I can just re-roll it. Yeah, yeah. It's... If you want, you can roll in um, Discord too. I'm gonna let the pup out real quick. She no is... problem being super obnoxious about going out right now. She must have to really go. No All problem. Right. Yeah, because we do a lot of rolling in Discord, and you can just do, like, excl what is it? Uh, exclamation R 100, I think. Or no. Uh, I wonder if, if it has anything. It shouldn't. Nope, that's not doing it. What the hell? There. Ah, there you go. All right, power check. The devil, the devil right, okay, no, that's it. That's good. Um, so you will. Um, you feel.
something come at you out of the darkness. Just this horrific energy. Um, but it manages to just kind of flow around you instead of through you. I mean, it just, and it, you're thirsty now for some reason. You're incredibly thirsty. Uh, all right, actually, since uh, he's doing that, I want to take a pee break uh, and Sounds grab good. a. Yeah. yeah, all right, all right. Sounds good. Taking a break. We had a break. Uh, got a big pee break. Okay. And I'll probably swim. Oh, yeah. uh. Uh. You guys take rifle shots in the dark, even if you're missing, man. It's <laughs> making them take cover. Uh, defend the bridge yep that's, uh, that's what we do ah so uh, blah, 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 blah. Right. Um, look at that combat tracker for me uh, does it say next the rat, rat thing Hold on, there. No. Yeah, rat thing one is up. So there's two rat things, a twisted cultist and a warp. Okay, cultist. all right, all right, right. Yep. Yeah, I'm going strictly theater of the mind here, because what you can see, you can actually see. So we're good with that. He's going to move up. At the... I don't know... If Gunther can see, or uh, Gunner can see it, but Adam, you definitely can. Gunner, right on the edge of the field of, you know, just you can see something else is down there on the water. Um, Tony, I need you to make a power roll for me. Okay. Right there. Four. Extremely successful. Three levels of success. Yes. Extremely successful. Um, As you look at this, you realize that what you're seeing is the outline of a man. He's in robes. And he's just, just, you can tell that he's extremely emaciated and thin. And not quite enough to really affect your mind the way seeing some of these things does, but it's close. This guy is not right. And you see a flash of green light from his eyes. And literally, everything just flashes green. But you realize it's kind of like a flash from your own eyes. You see him 
knock back and get staggered. And then he scrambles. And you can see him. He's come up and he's actually on dry land. But, I mean, he's on all fours. Just scrambling up toward him. Close. Um, he's close. He's, he's very close. So if I'm looking down, he's like at the base. Right. I mean, he Oop. can't come up to you, but yeah, he's right at the base of that cliff now. Mm-hmm. Okay. On the bridge, you realize that you see something large kind of hopping as quick as it can over this bridge. It is making a beeline for Teresa and uh, Gunner. And it gets probably about halfway across the bridge. Just as it, you know, reaches the end, as it just goes as far as it can, you hear a splashing in the water. Something splash, splash, and you see another shape like this big, kind of toad like shape comes in. You know, I need both of you to make a sanity check for me, please. Sixty-three. Seventy-two. And are those passes or fails? Are they higher or lower than, uh, or is it, uh, what is your sanity score? Eighty-two. It's my, the, I roll lower than my sanity score. Okay, then you take one sanity point loss is all. The same for me. All right, you each take one sanity point loss as you realize this thing is not anything any of you have ever seen. It is um, <laughs> squat, kind of a pale white. Um, and it looks like almost a cross between a frog and a bear, but no skin. Um, you know, just shape wise. So it's is not this the tall. thing that is this the thing that I fired at and killed? Uh, you did fire one of these and killed, yes. Oh, one of them. There's another one. Cool. <laughs> and it is uh it is on the near side of the river. And It froze lost. up there, Chris. Something. We, we lost. You, you broke up there. You said okay. it's on the near side of the river. He's gone. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I was right here. Let me just, just get out of here. Okay, so. I think that's everybody. I just got to move tokens up so they will be reflected. Uh, you are no longer targeted. He stayed there. God, this map is dark. That is. I do not want to. All right, he's dead. Yep, you see that there? Dead. Oop, no, he's over here. Wrong spot. You are not dead. But you will get deleted. This is the one that I shot. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, yeah, you're down to him. All right. Nope, you're back. Yeah, that, that, that. That one's still... Yeah, there's one there. I actually pulled the wrong token, but yeah, and this guy would... 
actually be back here. And I think this one fell out of turn order. Yep, I, I got to add them all again. The, okay. There's a there's a macro that's running that's screwing up everything for me. Huh. <laughs> it keeps knocking shit back and screwing up my bridge. There we go. All right. Boop, 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 and caught up. Bink, 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 bink. Teresa at this time finally has a shot. And she's going to finally take it. We're going to use that because I don't feel like that. Oh, lovely shot. Open this up. You only assume so since the question marks. Oh, it's a GM roll. Sorry. She got an extreme success. Nice. Yeah, she got a two. <laughs> Way to go, Teresa. Do it again. <laughs> um, make sure you get the right one. Yep. All right. This guy. You just see another one of those things just kind of fall to its hands and knees. And she will try one more time. Uh, where is she? This will be at a penalty. Shot rings out. And she takes another shot and misses. Gunner. Having recoiled in horror at these things coming at you, what would you like to do? Uh, well, I guess I'm going to take a, a shot at this little fucker right here. When you're targeting the, the little one in the middle of the bridge, oh, I see him. Okay, I still yeah. so small, I couldn't see the target. <laughs> oh, now this character sheet has lost its Tommy gun and oh. all that grenade. That's annoying. Um, but I'll add that real quick here that I actually can do pretty quick. That. Let's see. Hand grenade. And are you using the rifle? No, uh, no. Can you add the Tommy gun back to my range? Oh. Oh, yeah, absolutely. How do I see like the equivalent of the proficiency, like what I know I'm better at? Um, I'll show you just one second. I have to update the skills uh, real quick. So if you if you go to your character sheet under skills, under firearms, um, the lower the number, the worse you are at it. Correct me if I'm wrong on any no, of this. No, that's stories. right. You're right. You're right. You are right. Um, so for me. Uh, my number there for rifle shotgun is 70, which means that as long as I get under a 70, it's a success. It's a success. Yeah. So whatever you just clicked on made my, my, just made my character sheet go back. Oh, hold on. You just, yeah. It made yeah. It I'm updating stuff right now. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. So yeah. You da, 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 da. Okay. Yeah. You're changing that. Okay. Yeah. Make that, um, make that Tommy gun like an 80. <laughs> Wasn't that good? <laughs> okay. Now, you also have that you do have the option of burst fire, which is three shots per round, roughly, or full auto, which you can just unload. So. Uh, 
just, just okay. so you know. Are you? Can you un put me out of edit mode now? Out of edit? Oh yeah, I think so. Um, you just click the little padlock. Okay. There you go. Okay, so I'm gonna take a shot with my Tommy gun. That this one. Guy. And then so burst. What is okay? So I've got burst fire or full auto. What are the what is that? What are the differences? Um, well, we need to load your gun real quick here. Hang on. For some reason, it emptied out. No, it didn't. Let me load it. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Well, you're not. It, but because we had to add it. Yeah, it's dumb. All right. So you just click it again. Because uh, it never rolled for you, so there you go. All right, so full yeah. auto will allow two different skills to be selected for the weapon. Uh, yeah, that's uh, that. That doesn't really make a difference. Uh, versus, versus, so yeah, you're on full this auto. Really, so what's the reason burst firing on full auto? Just the number of rounds that fire. Because you get damage like, per guess, bullet. Does each another... bullet get its own roll, or is it just like damage? Uh, no, they each get their own two-hit roll, or not? It, it groups of it. It'll go in bursts of five, and it'll calculate a two-hit. You'll have to roll for every group of bullets. I see. So, why why wouldn't you do this every single time? What's the well? Discipline? Because single trigger pull, you can only do two, and that's two bullets in the air or two bursts of bullets. If full auto, you get to unload all 20 rounds in one, you know, bang. Oh, right? okay. It'll just keep going until the magazine's empty. And do I only have 20 bullets on me, or do, do, I, do I have more? You have more, but you'll have to reload. You know? Okay. But yeah, it's just, you just got to switch right. out the magazine. Well, I'm going to do burst. You're going to do burst? Okay. And click, and let's make sure this works. Out of curiosity, what does it take to reload? Um, the, uh, you lose one of your shots. A, a turn or? Um, it's like a half turn. Um, you can shoot and fire at this and reload, but you'll take a disadvantage on your shot. Um, gotcha. So, but yeah, that was well, a pretty. That was a bad miss anyway. Uh, and he was it's penalty so because he's a small target. Um, and he's fast. He is moving anyway. This little guy is like dodging all over the place. They are extremely quick and hard to hit. Just so okay. you know. But I get to shoot again? Um, if you're doing burst, yes, you may. Oh, I went to out of ammo again. It is being dumb. What burst is five or is it three? Uh, in this one, a burst is... It was three. Yeah, it should be three. So, 17. Yeah, all right, there you go. So, try it again. I reloaded you. I don't like their automation. It's terrible. Wow. Mm. Now, you do, you, you can push rolls. All right, you can roll it again. It's just that if it goes badly, it goes very badly. Pushing that would be 41 points. No, 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 that's a luck. Pushing means you get to roll again. Pushing means you roll again. But when a pushed roll goes bad, it tends to go very bad. Like in a case like this, that means the gun explodes in your face. Got it. So, I mean, you know, or, you know, could be anything, but yeah, you know, it's so. Pushing a roll is risky, but it lets you try again. You can just have a failure and have nothing go wrong, but if you have a critical failure, it's like an, you're, an extreme failure becomes a critical failure. So, good God, this thing, why is it bumping every round that you shoot? Uh, all right, click it again. And I'm going to use right. luck. Can't use luck on a push roll. That's the one limit. <laughs> but I'm not going to have the gun blow up in your face. It was a failure, but it's, it becomes an extreme only failure. By one. It's, it's only yeah. by one. It's not about 
bitch. Dude, there's no way I was rolling three nineties in a row. <laughs> Jeez. Oh. Rimini. Yeah. I took three shots and failed. Yeah. Yep. And I'm right there with you. And that'll end my turn. Alright. And Tony, you now are standing here above this scene. You see stuff just coming across the river. You got one thing right below you, kind of. You, know, you see some something's coming across the bridge. You've got at least two things around the bridge that you can see. Oh, shit. I was zoomed in too much. <laughs> hey Gunner, things are looking a little hairy here. Uh, I'm thinking I'm leaning towards blowing the bridge. Uh, make a kill zone right around there. And see me just point down to the middle, funnel them in. All right. Um, and I'm gonna take a shot. I'm gonna use luck for that. All right. Well, uh... if that doesn't down it, I'm gonna take another shot. And he tries to dodge, but cannot get out of the way. And here. to do that. All right. Uh, he's down, but he does not, you know, it's like you can see it, it, it's knocked him over. And you can see him scrambling, trying to get on his feet again. Let's take another shot. Right. Finish him while he's down. All right. He's uh, prone. Do you get advantage? Uh, not really in this one. They don't have that. Ooh, roll damage. The right. 12 points, as soon as it goes down, I'm going to lay one right into its chest. And sure enough, he just kind of just poof. Like a seasoned sniper, you just take him out. And the body goes still. How are you guys doing up at the front? Terrible. That sucks. <laughs> that's my turn, I think. I'm going to yep, post up it. here and, and see one, uh, oh, probably one more turn and see what happens, but. <laughs> um, yeah, I think we might be getting close to blowing it. Uh, oh wait! He Call can't Gunner. Do that. Uh, he has one actually, but that won't help him very much. Uh, da, da, da. Yeah, this little guy. Target her. Out of the dark, almost onto her back, this thing comes leaping out at Teresa. Uh, she is going to take a maneuver. She's going to try and hit it into the water. Um, good luck, Teresa. She absolutely does not. She takes a wide swing. And this thing... Takes a hit, takes a bite at her. Oof. Ooh, poor Teresa. Right, 
You see Teresa just, this thing is suddenly latched onto her back. It's biting right into her shoulder and just tearing at her as she begins to scream. And... Um, I'm going to yell out to her because I can see her. Right. I can see this. I'm going to yell out to her. to run, like run, run up towards, like, I want her to run away. Okay. I want her to actually run, I'm gonna say, Teresa, I'm, I'm gonna blow the bridge, follow me. Like, and I want her to run towards where I'm gonna go blow the bridge. Okay. If she's able to do that with that thing on her. Gotcha, all right. Tracker now. Uh, no, it's not. Get in the tracker. There it is. Oh, I see what's going on. No wondering. That didn't make sense. That's what I want. He's going over here. He goes into combat. This one goes away. And where are we at here? He went. This guy. And yep, he's still alive. All right. Gunner, you see this thing? One of those little small things come up. It just kind of sticks its head out over the wall. And I would like you to make a power roll again for me. Very nice. Once again, uh, no, not this time. You feel that same thing, that feel dry, wrong feeling again. Uh, and this thing just uh, looks at you, and you swear it's cussing at you. And it tries to dodge down below the railing a little bit. Teresa move was more of a reaction. It wasn't her turn. Right. It's not her. Right, right, right. I she took a shit. Yeah. Screen. I was looking at the. No worries. That screen. Aha. Uh, uh -huh. That. that you hear this weird chant and I need you Mr. Tony to make a sanity check no power roll yeah make a power roll Oof. once again Push Here's back. Like, the hell is that? <laughs> <laughs> it was a scary sound. This guy chanted and tried like the best it could to really mess you up. Once again, you just repel it as if it was nothing. 
That sign is called giving away your location. <laughs> I start turning towards him. <laughs> I know where you're at. <laughs> and this guy. Where is Assume this Assume it came guy? from this direction. Uh, no, actually it came from uh, this direction out here. It was from the bait from the bridge. From the bridge. Yep. This, this thing. Got <laughs> it. And what does this guy have? Oh, I don't know which one. So we're gonna give him I know what we'll do. Uh no. Uh that. There we go. Oh, I gotta, I have to make a target. Poor Tony. Everybody can see you. All right, Tony, if you would make a, uh, actually, yes, a constitution check. I've been telling it wrong, but that's okay. You passed them all anyway. Holy crap, dude. You're like beast. You feel yet another wave of that. And what's his dex? 50 moves. Listen, you guys are just making this easy for me. <laughs> guys are just brutal and it, it gets closer it's moving in and it's like getting as close as it can to you at the base of this cliff and which brings us to the top Teresa was not real happy to have this thing on, the, on her back is going to try and get this thing off using a fighting maneuver See how she does. We'll let her do a brawl. She grabs this thing by the head and just literally just slams it up against the tree. Um, oh, does the maximum she could. And nice little front. Yep, and. You see, it's just kind of stuck on the tree. <laughs> on a knob of a branch, impaling it from its back, and it's just kind of laying there, twitching, hanging off this tree. Yes. And she's like, I'm... Yeah, she's, and she starts running over and getting in the truck. She's like, I'll get this stupid thing clear. And she hops in the truck. And that's about all the time she has for All right, Gunner. Um, okay. I'm pretty sure that dynamite is going to blow up that truck if I blow this bridge. I would know that, right? I'm, I'm asking. Like, I would know. Uh, yeah, yeah. And you also realize that there, there's fuse. It's got to burn for a little bit. It'll be a turn or two before that fuse cuts. So to me, I mean, if you light the end of the fuse, it'll be like two rounds of combat. Um, okay. If you light it closer, you know, you can guess, you can get it within a round. Um, you'd have to get right up on the bridge to light it close enough to blow the whole thing at the, you know, right there, okay. which would put you there. All right. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to move to right here. Okay. With Oh, excuse me. Actually, no. I was kind of right in. Well, I was right where I wanted to be. I was. I was right yeah. here, and the the line kind of runs in between that tree where I was, right through me. I'm kind of standing on the line. Right. Actually. Okay. Whoops. So sorry. If that's the case. God damn it. <laughs> I'm gonna light the fuse. Okay. All right. And I'm gonna say, let's fucking go. <laughs> and then I'm gonna. I'm down here. Is this is this a tree? Is this a tree right here? I'm just gonna move and I'll move back. Is this a tree right here? Yeah, but you do realize as you're starting to step that way, you're getting real close to the things that are down by the river. 
right? That's a scramble down to the riverbank if you go that oh. direction. Okay, well then I'm just gonna, well, am I in the blast radius of this TNT where I'm at? Yeah, you probably wouldn't want to be real close. This is kind of feeling close to it, you know? Okay. Well, shit. Now I'm fucked. Um, <laughs> so I light the fuse and then I say, let's fucking go. And then I'm going to say, oh, fuck. <laughs> uh, you can move that direction, which does start getting you away from the bridge. <laughs> which direction? Um, well, you know. Back this way? Yeah, yeah, anywhere back up or that way. I can't do that yeah. because then I won't be able to see anything. Ah. Uh, um. Maybe just a, just a smidge. How much of that do I actually get in a round? Uh, you get... Uh, da, 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 your move, you get seven yards per turn. That's it. It's essentially four, seven squares, right? Seven squares, essentially, yeah. Okay. Then if that's the case, I'm going to move one, two, three, right here. Okay. And then with my Tommy gun, I'm going to shoot at this dude right here. Well, you've already used an action. You lit the fuse and you move, oh. so you're kind of out of action. So you can revamp if you want. What do you mean I can re What is that? Yeah, you, you don't, you, you don't, you're not committed to moving where you did because you wouldn't have done that maybe if Okay, you... so I can't do any action. Lighting the fuse was my action. No, lighting, yeah, that's pretty much it, so. I mean, you, you could take a shot, but that'd be without moving. Okay. So can I, is it a, how long did it take Tony to get, I can't climb up this wall, right? Uh, you'd only be able to get about a third of the way there. Cause you'd have to, you know, head off towards this way. Um, okay. and then, and then from there, it's a scramble up kind of back down to where he's at on the map. Okay, well then, if that's the case, I'm just going to get as far away from this. Um... Yeah, you know, just up in that direction somewhere. And now I'm out of the blast radius? Uh, you're close. I'll get behind but... this tree. I'll there you go. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. And then that'll be it. All right. And then I'm going to light a cigarette. <laughs> all righty. The same match, he lit the fuse. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> lights a cigarette, like lights the fuse with it, and walks like off. Here you go. <laughs> and just lay <laughs> within the tree. <laughs> okay, Tony, what would you like to do? <clears throat> uh, so I see him do this. Um, I see this thing coming up. Teresa took care of business on her end. She's in the truck, ready to move it. I'm going to take a shot at this thing. Alrighty. Holy Jesus. I'm just going to lean over and see it coming up and put one right between the eyes. Dude, that's amazing. No bonus dice. Rolled a 12. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Roll seven. back over, sit up, and uh, head off this this direction. Now, uh, is because I was prone this this whole time. Right, right. Like on my on my stomach. Is it like half to get, to stand up, or is that a thing? No. Uh, no, we don't. We, we don't bother with that. This this is okay. this is pulp, man. <laughs> so one. Okay. You can do it. pull a somersault Three. backwards into the air and running. <laughs> uh, now it took a bit to get up this, or does, is it like a walk up? Can I just um, no? You can you can kind of sprint down. down. You, you can do full movement. It's yeah, it's it's steep. Okay. It's not that steep. So, so I got one, two, three, four, five, six. As I run by Gunner. Let's meet up by the truck, and I'm just gonna keep going. Seven, eight, nine. All right. Uh, I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep go this way. A little kind of 
out around <laughs> the bridge. And that's my turn. Alrighty. Um, actually, I see this little this little guy here. Uh huh. Can I take a shot at him? Uh, or is, you can. Is move, shoot, move. Uh, okay. Yeah, no, you can. You can. Um, you, you know. Okay. It'll be at disadvantage. Uh, yes, it would. Um, yeah, because it's a small target anyway. And he's yeah, definitely regular minus target. one. Got it. Yeah. yeah, nothing. I just see him just kind of like take a shot and <laughs> keep moving. All right. Ba -ba -ba. And it is. All right. Oh, that one's dead anyway, so yeah. That's my turn. And that thing. <coughs> hmm. Let me check something. How many has he got? How long has this whole thing taken? Um, it's been just two or three minutes, minutes at most. Yeah, it's not very long. Yeah. Hmm. The only thing so he sees on, is... Like, how much more is coming. This <laughs> blowing the bridge. Would, that's, <laughs> that's seeing just this first wave. Uh, let me see. I'm going to give him a fighting chance at this, to be fair. Hmm. All right. Uh, he looks and he sees, you know, those strange sunken eyes recognize the light glimmering from the fuse. So he in turn decides he's not going to come down that bridge. to do Whew. she got lucky and you just see that same green flash you saw uh, but not at you guys this time and, you know you kind of hear a vis uh, an oof as the truck starts She starts that truck. Um, she indeed. Oops. Just her in the truck. She backs up the truck so that it's a little bit further away. But still aiming as she's. Pulls back right in. She's just backing through the brush trying to get away from the potential explosion here. And Gunner, as your turn comes up, first thing that happens. Flash of light. Bridge blows. Debris flies everywhere. And this guy is gone. <laughs> The, that crazy, weird-looking guy is just no more. Tony's, Tony's leaning up against the tree, facing the opposite direction, smoking a cigarette, and he just starts laughing. <laughs> Tony's hitting the dirt. <laughs> I'm hitting the dirt. <laughs> yeah, there's sticks and wood flying over your head. You know, the trees are just pinging with shrapnel and splinters. Tony! <laughs> <laughs> In the light of the headlights, you see a uh, tremendous number of uh, boards and debris just everywhere. And why did you keep driving? the bridge, not the river! <laughs> you 
can kind of hear a strange roaring sound all the way across as these things are not very happy at all. For the moment, um, next. Uh, are you doing anything else, Gunner? Yeah. Um, I'm going to. Well, I technically, I don't know if this is. I mean, I can still see a dude at the other end of the bridge right now. Right. So I might as well take a shot with that. Alrighty. Well, how much? What was the penalty for or the movement for switching? What's the range of a Tommy gun? Tommy gun's only about thirty yards. It's way. It's extreme range at best. I mean, it's. And you're, thirty uh, yards is right. What he's at? He's at ninety feet. Uh, let me pull up your sheet and see what the Tommy gun says. Uh, ba -ba -ba. And I'll probably load it for you if that has. Been. It's 20 yards is its range. Okay. And what's the penalty for switching weapons again? Uh, you'll use half of your action time, basically. You can switch and fire or fire more than once. Okay. Well, I'm going to switch over to my... All right. Rifle. And take a shot. Ooh, I, I multi-shot on... I have a multi-shot on a rifle? Not on that. No, I don't know why it's there. That, okay. Their system is terrible when you bring weapons in. All right, well, I'll take the shot at him. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, I'm going to use my luck. All righty. So I'm going to drop that by nine points, right? Is a tie a kill or a hit? Um, a tie. Like if I drop it at 40. If I, oh, if no, I, no. It's a, yeah, no, it's, it'll just, if, if, if you click that, it'll say spend 11 luck points to pass. Like uh, the red firearms yeah. rifle shotgun failure. Yeah, yeah. It'll open it up and then scroll down. Oh, scroll down. Okay. Spend 11. Mm. Yeah. 15 points. Um, yes, but unfortunately he decided to dodge. Yeah, I'm kidding. <laughs> All right. Usually they've been failing him. Yeah, he's he's. Pretty... Tony, are we corralling or are we are we running? What's what do you want to do here? We gotta take care of it. What's ever on this side of the bridge, and then keep them funneled <laughs> down this path. Of, they're getting across the river. Well, the ones on the bridge can't cross now. I would assume, right? The one that they they can't get over the bridge has been exploded. That's that's my assumption. They they can't go across, right, Tim? All right, then um, it, it's, I mean, it, could they? Uh, maybe, but I mean, the bridge just, I mean, it looks like shit. So there we okay. go. Yeah, it just left so, debris. Going Sorry about to... that. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm going to move over to this side of the tree. And I don't see if I scan around, I don't see any other creepy crawlies, so I'm gonna just bat them down right here. Alright. Alright, Tony. I'm gonna move this uh, gunner firing in this direction. Where? There he is. Right. Yeah. I'm gonna sidle up beside Gunner and take aim at this guy. Okay. And I'll use luck for that. Alrighty. Five points. 
All right, roll damage. Seven. All right. Ooh. You hear a bellow in the so night. Go down into. I'm gonna kneel down and put the rifle up on my knee. All right. And take a shot and then. Well, I'm gonna realize as I take aim to go for another shot, I just hear a click. Yep. Fuck. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna take my other half of my turn to reload. Alrighty. Alright. Yeah, there's a certain point where, yeah, you, you do have to worry about ammunition, so, which is understandable. Alright. I'm going to yell out to um, Teresa, get him over here. And uh, to, to Gunner, I, I just turn over and look at him. This is the kill box. Anything that crosses that river, we just take it out. We'll post up here for the night. Copy that. All right. Um, I would like... Tony and Gunner, and of course her, to all make a spot hidden check for me. Nope. I am dead focused on what's in front of me. Yeah, okay, alright. Alright. Well, in that case, alright. Where are we at in that? Alright, that. The hell is Teresa doing? <laughs> uh, we can't hear you for whatever reason, Chris. All right, got me now. There we go. Yeah, yeah. my mic unplugged. Um, <laughs> must have been equally weird with me not being able to talk. Um. She's honking the horn, and you can see one of those things hissing at her out of this tree. Kind of a, uh, you, 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 you can just kind of maybe see it. I don't know if you can or not, but right here on the side of this tree. Should be within your field of view. No, I can't see it. Uh, um, but she just aims at these trees then. You're not sure why, but she's, you know, and she's honking the horn. And that takes about, you know, she's here starting to get out of the truck. But that's about all she can do. Gunner. Okay. Well, all right. Um, I think I'm going to move. One, two, three. Oh, I can see one. I can see one. I'm going to shoot it. All right. And I still have my rifle in my hand. Yep. You had not swapped. Oh. What's up? Oh, no, nothing. Yep, take a shot. Base range. Oof. I don't think I think I've hit once. I think I've hit once. 
Well, shooting in the dark at things in the shadows, you know, that's actually stands to reason. But yeah, they're, you're, the dice have kind of hated you. Okay, so then I'm like back four. So I'm back. <laughs> All right. One, two, three, four. All right. And that'll end it. Yeah. Although okay. I'm still I'm still confused over whether or not I could have taken another shot. I uh, if you had me, yeah, you absolutely could have. Even with movement, you could take another one just at a penalty die if you want. And you can go uh, ahead and just roll you, that now. Yeah, just I'm go ahead and roll it. that. You don't have to. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. have at it. And, uh, Boom. Is this and this is at disadvantage? Uh, let me change this real quick. Long range. Uh, there you go. Now just click uh, roll firearms. 84. That would have been hard anyway, so yeah. And now you can move if you wish. Okay, now I'm I'm not where I was where I was going. Okay. Yep. Anthony. It's up to you now. Whoops. Okay. Yeah. Move forward. Okay. Two, three, four, five. See this thing? No. Which there thing? it is. Yeah. The thing that Gunner was shooting at. Gotcha. And that I was shooting at. Um. I would have seen it from back here. Yeah. Um, I'm going to look at Gunner. Yeah. You got this? I'm going to go see what she needs. Uh, sure. I'm, I'm on fire tonight. You go <laughs> check her out. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to run. One, two, three, eight, nine. Okay. I still can't see what the hell she's looking at, so I'm going to run up and look at her and go. <laughs> All right. And she's just staring, looking at something. Um... Um, is a, is a, does she point? Actually, hold on, hold on. Let me, it's kind of a limit because of the way this thing works. So let me uh, do something here. It may actually. She like, there you go. Up or down? Uh, like where Take is Take a look this? again. Take a look again. And see. Oh, I see it. I see it now. It's just, yeah. it was, a, the, the light just didn't quite cover it. So, and she wouldn't have left it in the side there. So yeah. Okay. Um. So is it up? It's about six feet off the ground, clinging to the side of the tree on a low branch. I'm going to try and take it off. Okay. It is going to try and avoid that. Mm. And it does. Yeah, I'm going to take another shot at it. All right. Nope. Yep, it's just moving too fast. It's kind of like a squirrel on this tree. Yes. Yeah. Just a huge fan. I'm behind the tree. All right. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to yell back to Gunner. Oh, wait a minute. There's another oh, little one up on the tree here. <laughs> well, it wasn't your turn, actually. It's over, over was, the river. I don't think it was your turn anyway. Yeah, it was. Okay, yeah. So, all right. I'm going to yell at Teresa. Get those lights over at the river. <laughs> Um, That's my turn. All righty. Uh, whoops. No, no, there we go. No, I didn't know I could do that. I'm hearing you. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, he is. One, two, three, 
quick as a flash. This thing just comes out of the dark, bleeps at you there, Tony. And uh, let me get some skills here. I'm going to give him a proper chance here. Skills. Um, yep, 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 uh, fighting. Bite. As it comes running up, uh -huh. I try to impale it with my bayonet. Okay, you may. Uh, there is do nothing, of course. You may try and dodge. Um, you may try a fighting maneuver. Um, or you may fight back. That will qualify as fighting back. And you will make it, basically you'll both make a, uh, a brawl roll. Or a brawl in whatever he rolls. And in a tie there is no damage. Um, other than that, it's you get to do damage or he gets to do damage. Because <coughs> he is coming at you, <coughs> mouth wide. Leaping in the air, attempting to bite you. And, uh, yes, you, uh, you jab at him. Um, you don't actually have a bayonet on this thing, but I'll let you roll four, uh, 1d4 to see if you can uh, you know, impale him or what it does to him. Oof. And this thing just leaps out, just... Like some kind of like insane man. You just literally stick your rifle straight out and the barrel sinks into its gut. And you now have this I wouldn't I wouldn't want to damage the barrel. I just take the Oh, okay. Stuff, I take the the butt of the gun and just bring it across and just crack it and right it, across and it's, the face. It's, it's, you may as well have hit it with a baseball bat and you took it right in the head and you just hear a sickening popping sound. <coughs> as Part of the head goes this way, and the, the body just kind of falls to your feet as the head just went its own direction, and the body kept going, and it is gone. And still taking shots from you, this thing is not happy. And it starts scrambling further away into the darkness. Oh, I need to get in there. Until you kind of lose sight of it. And I need to roll for reasons. Let me do something here. Oh, he doesn't even. So... Where is it? Oh, down at the bottom. And I'm kind of rolling my in. Private, good. Good. You could hear this thing. It's way off in the distance, but even over the water, you can hear this thing tearing through the branches. Kind of off. You don't know exactly where, but you, you, you know it's this direction. It's somewhere over here. All right. It's just, it, it, it's moving through the underbrush like a bear. It's not even a little bit quiet. And that's all you know about there. Um, Teresa will now hop in to the truck and indeed lines back up where the bridge was. Actually, she's kind of realizing there's not a whole lot there of the bridge left. No, I, I would have wanted her to point the, the lights at the river. Right. Like That's, at, at the... Here we go. Try to... Yeah, there's there's uh, trees the, and stuff, if but... The truck is, if the truck is there, pointing that, down... Well, the, there's a drop right in this area. And not sure the truck would he be able to really get down that embankment. Uh, Got it. But yeah, so it's like this way or yeah, that's good. Yeah. That's um, good. Yep. All right. I'm gonna yep. see if I can get. Yeah, that's really about your only option. I'm gonna move it a little bit. So you kind of no, that doesn't help. <laughs> Actually, I know what I'm gonna do here because 
there's two headlights, so I can justify this to myself. We'll get rid of this. And this. There we go. There we go. So she gets out. She's right on the edge of the bridge there and just kind of aiming down. You can see the uh, the embankment clear. You know. Um, so we were looking for. Right. So, yeah, I figured you're looking to see if there's anything that comes in there. Yep. All right. Uh, and we're still kind of in combat, but really not. So we're just going to keep it up just because it's already there. Uh yep. And what are you going to do as things go along? Uh, and yeah, you can hear this thing is thrash. You can hear it on the far shore. It's a little hard to see because you got bright light next to you, but you can hear this thing is shifting along back and forth along the edge of the water. It is not so quiet. If I, a, if I have a chance, I'm going to run over, get beyond the light, Okay. And take a shot at it. All right. Uh, can your, your token see it from there? I can't see it from there. All right. Um, yeah, as, the, as you get across, you stop, and you realize it has gone silent, and you have lost sight of it in the dark. Oh, wait. Nope. No? Oh, there you uh, go. Yeah, yeah. You, got, you can just see an outline of it just barely. Just barely see it. Yep. And woo. And I just get Ooh. down on one knee <coughs> and post the rifle up and take aim and take a shot. Steady myself as it goes. And that. Kills the last thing alive. Nice shot. And as you sit, yeah, so hopefully it's the last one we need. In anticipation, there's no more sounds. Nothing else seems to be coming. Or nothing else is heard, anyway. And... After a very long night. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna. Yeah, I'm assuming you stay posted up, but yeah, it's, I'm uh, just you know. gonna squat down, posted up with the rifle up on my knee, and just keep an eye on this embankment. Uh, All right, listening, and every once in a while, I'm shooting the shit with gunner. <laughs> yep, trading <laughs> stories while I'm watching. There we go. I couldn't get that. That macro kept firing all the time, and I don't know why. That was really weird. The bridge. I don't know below. what macro it is. Um, it's a custom-made macro. So, you know, let's... Yeah, there it goes. Ah. It actually made debris and sounds and lights, and then awesome. it just worked when nobody was here, and then I logged in, and it just sucked. <laughs> you need to test your macros. I did. That's the annoying thing. I tested it over and over again. So anyway, uh, you actually helped the other group tremendously. Um, this saved Sally's life. If you had failed, Sally would have died. Just to let you know. Um, uh, you're Connie's Cubs, you're the strike team, and you did really well. Uh, those are not shabby. Um, having nice rifles and firearms is uh, a huge advantage um, yeah, yes it is but you'll find that uh you know you guys were stranded there for quite a while uh <laughs> as there was no getting across this bridge um you know somebody will assume somebody finally hiked out um got a construction crew to come in and just make a, an emergency rope bridge um, actually, it was the uh, the Oregon State Guard was called out, and they place a bridge out and get you guys the hell out of there. Um, 
with many thanks, um, they bring in a relief team to watch them for the rest of the time. So you guys are done. Um, they have actual regular, you know, guardsmen in now, um, but there's no way they could respond fast enough. Uh, and congratulations. That was phenomenal. You guys did great. <laughs>